If you're looking to leave the room with an absolutely intoxicating and powerful scent trail, this is my recommendation to you. Hi guys, and welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Andrea, also known as Curly Scents, and thank you so much for stopping by. Boys, this video has been a long time coming. I'm almost five years on YouTube and I never did a video like this. Today I'm giving you seven of the longest lasting, most projecting fragrances that I also find incredibly sexy on a guy. Now, typically I tend to favor scent over performance. Because let's be real, would you rather smell like warm shed for 12 hours <laughs> or smell absolutely heavenly for six? But don't worry because today you don't have to choose one or, or the other. Pearly Sense is here. I got you. Because every single one of these fragrances are both beast mode and incredibly attractive. With that being said, we are starting with Mancera Red Tobago, aka The Red Beast. Two sprays with this one. Otherwise, I'm not gonna survive through this video. Now, hear me. You have tobacco fragrances, and then you have this. To me, this is in a league of its own. Let me start by saying that I am not a huge fan of tobacco fragrances in general. So for this to be in my video is saying many things. This is not your average tobacco that is overly watered down with sweetness, vanilla, and honey. No, this is some manly juice that demands attention. To me, this is a smoky yet wet, juicy cherry tobacco with a beautiful almost chocolatey patchouli and an underlying vanilla. Such a rich, deep and bold scent that in my opinion, you absolutely have to dress up. Like if you attempt to step out the door with this casually, the fragrance is gonna literally eat you alive and have no mercy. Moving into a completely different direction and we have Sospiros Vibrado. And I don't have a bottle, because the shit is expensive. <laughs> I, just, I just broke my two, two spray rule. Now, even though this fragrance is gonna cost you an arm and a leg and maybe a kidney, you don't have to worry about it because you won't be over spraying it. It's enough, two sprays will be enough and the bottle is gonna last you forever. This fragrance smells like endorphins. It will make you happy. It's sunshine in a bottle. This smells like a fizzy summer mocktail with such a summery blend of like citrus. I get orange, I get lime, I get grapefruit. Then you take a slap of mint and you add it in the glass. A little sliver of ginger and top it off with some Sprite, sir. And all the mamacitas on the beach will be craving a taste. There's a lot of versatility here. It's the perfect casual, fun, beachy scent, but at the same time, it's very sophisticated and gentlemanly. 100% signature worthy. Everyone says that fresh citrusy fragrances don't last. So Spiro Vibrato says, hold my beer. Next up, we have Unique Luxury. Oh, crush on me. And I'm currently crushing really hard on this fragrance. Oh. This is one of the most unique semi-gourmand fragrances I've ever smelled. And my God, it is potent. Okay, let me paint the picture here. Imagine that a Tootsie Roll had intercourse with a caramel candy. Their baby was delivered on a bed of patchouli leaves and then sprinkled with shavings of ginger and a squeeze of lime. Now tell me if that doesn't sound freaking unique. Although not listed in the notes, I do get a very prominent booziness and also a coffee brown sugar vibe that I absolutely adore. It's very sweet and delicious, but at the same time, spicy and masculine earthy, which makes this scent so alluring to me. Keep this one for special occasions or really anytime you want to turn some serious heads. I guarantee that nobody in the room will smell like you. And and you will also be filling that room with two sprays. Who would I be if I didn't add this fragrance to a list like this? Who? Savage Elixir by Dior. That's all you need, trust me. I won't speak too long about it because most of you already know my complete obsession with it. Let me just say, it's a amazing. But for those who don't know, this is the only Savage that you need in your life. Insanely spicy in the best way possible. Old school meets modern, sexy dad, barbershop vibes. A hint of sweetness and the most addictive, musky, woody dry down. Now I gotta say, I think you need at least two or three chest hairs to pull this one off. If you don't, that's okay too, as long as you fit the vibe. And the vibe of Savage Elixir is confident, masculine, and alpha male. A massive compliment getter, but just don't do 
don't overdo it. I know it's tempting, but you seriously only need three sprays. And I would even suggest to spray this on about an hour before you go out, just to settle down and get to that sweet, sweet spot. The next fragrance is one that you guys repeatedly ask me to try, so I got it. And yes, it is a masterpiece. <laughs> what can I say? We're talking about Bois Imperial by Essential Parfum, and I'm gonna spray it now. <laughs> oh. Guys, this is one that you need to own for the upcoming spring and summer. Not to mention, this is probably the most nuclear fresh fragrance I've come across. Very, very heaven with a peppery spice, strangely metallic and marine in a way, with a captivating musky and woody dry down. And yes, if you couldn't tell, I love musky woody dry downs. To me, this is pure elegance in a bottle at a very inexpensive price point. If you like the style of Kenzo Ohm EDP, which you guys know I go absolutely nuts for, then I think you're gonna love this one too. And coincidentally, these were both made by my favorite perfumer, Quentin Biche. For some reason, this smells like London to me. Like a picture, good looking, sophisticated, fashionable man walking down the streets of London. Such a clean, refined, unique, yet mass appealing scent that apparently is a huge compliment getter for a lot of men. The perfect anytime, anywhere scent that will last you the entire day. All right guys, when it comes to ultra seductive and insanely long lasting fragrances, the Middle East is where it's at, hands down. And so at the number one spot, we're talking about Scorpion Intense by Odeon Dubai. This is oud and rose done right. If you told me a few years ago that I would be head over heels for an oud rose fragrance, I would have said that you're out of your damn mind. But here we are. If you're a guy who's in need of a sexy, dark, mysterious, expensive smelling night out scent, this is my recommendation to you. Opulent rose with a smooth oud and deep juicy berries. Now we all know that there's a lot of rose oud fragrances out there, but this is easily my favorite because it finds the perfect balance between Dubai royalty and mass appeal. An incredibly easy to wear oud for those of you who are a little bit on the fence with that note in uh, in general. The guy who wears this has a mysterious aura around him. He doesn't say too much and women are intrigued to know who he is and what he's about. He's very understated, but let me tell you, this fragrance is quite the opposite. If you're looking to leave the room with an absolutely intoxicating and powerful scent trail, you have to check this fragrance out. I absolutely adore it. So there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this list of the sexiest, longest lasting, strongest projecting fragrances in my humble opinion. If you did, be sure to subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, and let me know in the comments what your favorite long lasting fragrances are. See you soon. Mm -hmm.